Hello. Rose and Crown. Yeah, this is Ted, Beth, and Jace from Theme Park Fantasy. Uh, today we're going to be doing the dining package at Rose and Crown Pub. Yep, first night of... Epcot Forever. Epcot the, Forever. New, the new show, Epcot Forever. Yep, so we're going to be excited to see how that goes. Let's go inside and check it out. That's good. What does it have for flavoring compared to a regular? It tastes like your breakfast if you had everything um, all wrapped in uh, one. Yes, it's basically a home fry wrapped over a sausage wrapped over a hard boiled egg. It tastes oh, okay. good. Okay. Okay. Excellent. So here, let's go for the leek soup. The leek soup. The potato and leek soup. Oh, that's good. That's very good. It tastes like a chowder. It tastes like a very nice, like a clam chowder with no seafood in it. Okay. I'm not a chowder fan, but I do love the broth of a chowder, so. Oh, that's very good. That is very good. Nice and creamy, nice taste, nice texture. It's kind of like a pup cheese with chives in it. Okay. So that was better, thank you. It comes with. <laughs> It's a mouthful. It comes with your pickle lily, which is just pickled vegetables. Okay. In the middle, you're going to have your white Irish cheddar. Ooh. That's going to come with the sweet red onion jam. Nice. Good combination. That's actually my favorite. Nice. I was pleasantly surprised by the onion jam. Okay. And the last is going to be your uh, Irish porter that comes with a raisin, almond, and black currant reduction. Oh, neato. Thank you, sir. So, we're going to try the first one first. We'll let you people know what it is. So, this is all new for us. Not used to having food. That's the pub cheese and shredded pickle, correct? I yeah. believe so. Because yeah, the other one's a jam. It's a piccalilli. Pickled vegetables, basically. Pickled pickle vegetables, exactly. Yep, you definitely just taste the pickling. It's really good with the cheese. Uh, well, I'm surprised. Okay, which one do you guys want to try that one next? You're getting my face when you do this one. Okay, because it doesn't look like it is from the camera. Okay. Oh, sorry. Of course, for the pop cheese. Oh, very good. Good, thank, good. You. thank you. Very good. Try to get it all in one bite here. Yep. It's pretty good, isn't it? You're not sure you look at it. You're, it's really good together. That's very nice. Okay, um, so it tastes pretty good. Okay, it's very nice. These are very nice crackers. Yeah. I mean, they kind of have a cheese flavor to them. Yes. Um, the pup cheese is very good. It's soft. And the, and the pickled vegetables is very fantastic. Yeah, it really is. And I got the tomato leek soup. Looks good, along with the strongbow ale. Jace, what'd you get? I got the scotch egg, which is basically an egg that's been hard boiled, wrapped in sausage, and then fried. It sounds terrible, doesn't it? And then what'd you get for the drink? Oh, I got the Duchess. Looks good, doesn't it? Before I get to your face, go ahead and see your reaction. Crackers are crisp. Pick and lily. Very good. Tart, vinegary. And pub cheese is very nice. It is nice. Like you said, Jace, you know, it is smooth. Okay. That's the leek soup that Ted ordered. I like the fried little onions on top. It's a nice choice. A little adder. Gives it some salt. 
good. This is the white cheddar with their um, jam. <laughs> that is a really, really good blend. Like Very subtle. It melts together. And it really rarely marinates well. This one, the first one is very, very good too, but it has more of a bitter taste to it. Uh, this one is more of a softer blend. So what was this one? That is a uh, cheddar, cheddar uh, with a relish uh, jam. Onion jam, yes. It's very, very good. It's very, very good together. Here we go. Nice. Don't waste the crackers, smooth. dude. Yeah, don't waste the crackers. It's really, really smooth together, isn't it? The other one's good also. This is more of a tart. A tart. Well, the cheddar has a sharp bite. Yeah. And the jam is really sweet. Sweet. So with it it works out. That's a good way to describe it. Absolutely. Jim's very nice. It's very nice, isn't it? With the cheddar, it's very nice. I like very the cheddar, good. it's got a nice bite to it. Yeah. I'm a cheddar fan, anyways, so. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's got a nice, really good. It's good. very nice, very nice. So, this is the last one. Um, I apologize, I do not remember what the cheese was. He did say it, but I forgot what it was. It had a reduction on top. Like a yeah, but it's not a reduction. Jay's sure right on that. And then it has a little bit of a side crumble. Oh, almonds. Good? Yes? No? It is very, very good. Um, you kind of have to wait a minute because the other two has the side earrings. This is more of a subtle, uh, very well. The, the, the vinaigrette on top is not too potent, so it doesn't take away from the cheese at all. It works very well together. Good. Yeah. What was that? Cheddar with the jelly. That's definitely the favorite. What's I agree. your favorite? The cheddar? I'd say the cheddar with the jelly, yeah. I like the first two just because I like the difference in taste and it definitely has great taste, so mm, yeah. absolutely. Okay. On the other hand, I also found that the scotch egg also has a mustard sauce underneath the garnish. Oh yeah, you didn't go so. miss that. I believe there's raisins on top of this as well. Do you? Yeah, I think okay. I see them. What do you think? See, it takes a minute. It takes a minute to get there. That's okay. It tastes like cheese. It doesn't have the strong taste of the pub cheese or the cheddar. Right. Um, I don't think it's intended to. Yeah. yeah. It's very mellow. It's so if you're not yeah. a fan of strong flavors, this is good. Absolutely. Um, other than that, it's nice. This is Ted's reaction to the scotch egg. We're going for the scotch egg. We got a little bit of egg. We got some. It's not bad, is it? I agree with Jace. It's breakfast all in one. We got our sausage, our home fries, and our egg all in one. It's very nice. Very good. Very nice. I like it. creative thing you can get at a British restaurant. But it is their big thing. It Fish is and chips is the British thing. That's right. Fish looks good. Hold on. It does look good. I know we've had it from the other window. It looks good. That's true. They do have that takeout window. Very good. That was really, really good. <laughs> Hot? It's fantastic. It's also quite hot. Very hot. All right. 
Yeah, but look at that, it does look amazing. Wow. Look at that fish. Yeah, looks amazing. Awesome. Yeah, it's, it's flavored excellent. What'd you get, Beth? I got the bangers and mash. Uh, a little bit out of my realm here. I don't know think I identify with is the potatoes. So let's Ooh, give this you a, a shot. plate of potatoes. It looks fantastic. It really, really does. How can you go wrong? Sausage, gravy, mashed potatoes. Oh. Okay. This is fantastic. My fear was that the sausage was going to be spicy. It's not. It complements very well. It's a nice, nice dish. Start. So I got the salmon sitting on a bed of rice. And let's see. Nice, moist. It looks beautiful. Cooked right. The veggie mix, almost like a slaw. The greens, it's good. Very nice. Very healthy. Perfect. Jace is trying the salmon. Oh, that's nice thick. Salmon. It is nice. That's very nice. A nice thick cut, so it's easier to cook. The veggies. Oh, that's a nice slaw. That's very nice. Go. All right, trying the bangers and mash. Nice. The sausage is very good, like mom said. Yeah, it really is. Potatoes. Creamy, good texture. Great tasting. And the gravy is nice with mushrooms in it. Everyone loves that mushroom gravy. Let's give this a try. How was that, Daddy? I mean, nice. Ted. Nice piece of fish. Okay. So that's the fry. fry. Those are really good. Thick cut fries, well salted. Yes. They are well salted. They're really good. Really good. But it's not overbearing salt. It's a very simple. Alrighty, guys. Let's follow up here. We have our dessert. As you can see in front. Jace, what were the three? We had the trifle. The nougat bar, which had a Union Jack on it, white chocolate, and then a toffee cake. What do you think? Mom? I love all three of them. I, they all have their own unique, unique taste, and they were all well, well put together. They tasted fantastic. What was your favorite? Uh, I don't know if I have a favorite. Usually I'm the fussy one, and I only pick one. Shame. I know, Shame. but I, all, I really liked all three. How about you, Jace? Well, because everybody loves a good Game of Thrones reference at Disney World, uh, I have to admit the trifle is probably my favorite, and then the nougat bar, and then the toffee cake. I, I agree. Then. The, 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 trifle. The, trifle, the trifle is for really sweet people. If you really like sweets, you'll like the trifle, yeah, and the good. nougat. And then the toffee is good, but it's for if you prefer a little bit of a bitter dessert. Yeah, it does have kind of a, a twang to it. Um, and the, the nougat bar, you know, it's chocolate. It was good, but the trifle... That was spot on. Yeah, so, absolutely. Some uh, nice fresh rubbers and really, really great tasting. Definitely. Yeah. Um, all, about, all in all, uh, doing this new adventure for us from Theme Park Fantasy to bring to you, this was a fantastic night. Um, it's a great opportunity if you want to try it yourself sometime. Wow, that was really cool. Almost like no time has passed at all. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so that was awesome. That Amazing. Was, yeah, worth the price. It definitely was worth it. Front row seat, it was right on the water. Yeah, it was like, what, 85, 86 bucks a person before person, tax. Uh, appetizer, um, includes entree, dessert, uh, a drink, uh, alcoholic or non-alcoholic, and coffee. Food was fantastic. Um, we're stuffed. We're stuffed. Yeah, yeah. the atmosphere is absolutely fantastic. It's comfortable. It's, it's comfortable. very comfortable. Yeah. For a fireworks viewing, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah fireworks viewing, we are right on the water. No one in front of you. Very few tables. So, if you want to do that uh, for the fireworks, unobstructed view. No little kids jumping up and down in front of you. No parents putting little kids on top of their shoulders. No one standing was, up in front of you, yeah. especially when you're someone short like myself. It, it was a truly awesome night. Yeah, it really was uh, well put together. The show, 
the show was good. We weren't sure what to expect after Illumination. Yeah, especially because Epcot Forever is the temporary Tem show before yeah. the real show, Jace. which we haven't heard much about. But yeah. uh, I thought it was really cool. There were some surprises in it, which is always nice. Um, I thought all in all, it was a great experience. Yeah, great and night out. So yeah. you know, if you haven't seen the show yet, uh, obviously we're going to try to put a link here. We also, you know, obviously did that video that is up right now, so you can take a look at that. Um, first day of the show, and we have the video here at Theme Park Fantasy. So please be sure to subscribe to us again to check out all the latest theme park stuff so we can help you live your theme park fantasy. So for Jace, Beth, and Ted, bye. Bye. Thank you.